Hi, welcome to Ben Life China. We have been on the road for a full month. We explore West Java, Central Java, Yogyakarta, and East Java. Now we are in Bali. Lots of my friends really love Bali. Anytime they got free time, they fly from Jakarta to Bali. In the past, I never understand why. I visited Bali many many times, but for business purposes, meeting, presentation, gala dinner, and then back to Jakarta. And the condition in the past is totally different. So this time, I'm giving a chance for us to experience Bali in a different way. Hopefully, after this trip, we understand why so many people really love Bali. This time, we start by visiting Bedugul area instead of the beaches. The reason is simple: we love mountains and cold temperature. So we really enjoyed the first couple of days in Bali because of the weather and the view. The pace feels slower here in Bedugul. We feel so relaxed and peaceful. Then on day three, we went south to the downtown for grocery shopping. Interestingly, we were welcomed by local products like incense, body care products, naturally made body lotions, soap bars, essential oils, etc. Really different from the normal grocery shop we had back in the capital city. I got several boxes of locally made incense sticks and some pots of body scrub. Interesting. I didn't have time for body scrub or things like this back home. In Bali, every day feels like holiday. Then we continue to drive to Seminyak Beach. We don't normally visit beaches because in Indonesia it's so hot and humid at the beach. That's why we always go to the mountains. Luckily, it was cloudy that day, so it wasn't extremely hot. We walk along the beach from Seminyak Beach to Kuta Beach. The sand is soft. Walking there barefoot was very relaxing. We start to understand little by little why Bali is so addictive. Makes people want to come and come again. We then visited a coffee shop at Kuta Beach, an outdoor one. All visitors were Western. We were curious why they like outdoor, not the indoor one with air conditioner. That's why we want to experience this as well. Surprisingly, the price is not too expensive. Actually, the beer is half price of what we paid at a resort in Malang. And the pizza was excellent, exactly like in Italy. And the wind, also the shade from the trees, made us feel cool, not hot at all. To maximize our experience in Bali, we decided to find a room to rent, so we can stay in Bali for at least a month. We can't stay in the car to sleep at night, definitely, it's gonna be too hot. We went to Sanur area and got a room that we like there. They also got a swimming pool. So we settled the rent payment instantly that day. Please let us know if you want to know more about the rental fee and living cost in Bali. We'll also take a walking tour for you to see the surrounding area of this place. But first, let's go shopping to a nearby supermarket to fill our fridge. Five minutes drive from our room, there is a huge supermarket called Grand Lucky. Back home, we also buy groceries at nearby Grand Lucky, so we feel like at home when shopping there. They also sell fast food, so it's convenient. We had lunch there before exploring more. Okay, now let's explore the surrounding area. The rooms here are actually fully occupied, but still very peaceful. Our neighbors are all western. They like to swim during the day when it's still sunny, while we prefer to swim early morning or late afternoon for the shade. This small lane is called Jalan Bumi Ayu, and Alia Living Sanur is located there, at the end of the lane. Do you see our camper van there? Let's turn left and then turn right to the main road, Jalan Danau Tamblingan. There are some warung or small shops there, where some tourists like to hang out until late night. 
Today, when I walk and using an umbrella, a Western uncle told me, Excuse me, it's not raining. <laughs> Must be ridiculous for him that I use an umbrella on a sunny day. So I told him, Yes, it's not raining, it's just sunny. I'm still trying to understand why they like sunshine so much. Many of them even already stayed a long time in Bali to retire here. While Alvin and I feel so hot here and take shower many times every day. Every time we walk outside, we are sweating and feel sticky, then go back to take shower. Please comment below, why do you like sunshine? Why you are not afraid of getting sunburn? It hurts, right? There is a Starbucks over there, within walking distance. Then there are shops. There is a Swiss Bell Hotel. There are also several convenience stores within walking distance, like Indomaret, and the next one is selling fresh vegetables and fruits. The name is Popular. Popular Express. There is a bread shop over there across the road. Bread basket. And there are several restaurants. Another convenience store here and this one is open 24 hours, Coco Mart. Oh, here it goes, the best for a sunny day, gelato! Let's have a quick break here. I think this is also a nice place to have dinner. They have options of pastas and beer. From this restaurant, you can see across the road there is another restaurant and then the access to the beach. So from our room, it's within walking distance to go to the beach, Karang Beach and also the consulate of Germany. Let us finish this gelato first and then we will go across to the beach. The difference here in Sanur Beach area compared to Kuta and Seminyak is the wave. In here, it's very peaceful. There is no big waves like in Kuta or Seminyak. Another difference here, Sanur Beach area is on the east part of Bali Island. So people come here for the sunrise, while Kuta and Seminyak Beach are on the west side of Bali Island. So they go there for the sunset. What else do you want to know more about Bali? Please let us know in the comment below. Please subscribe and activate the bell to get notified when we upload new videos. Thank you for watching. Bye!